Hey guys, it's uh, Randy from Getting There Green. We're going, we're going dizzy. Whew. Oh my goodness. Um, so I got a little project that uh, I want to get done today, and uh, I think I did a pretty good job. And uh, just kind of start, starting to get dark, and the bugs are starting starting to come out. I'm going cross-eyed. So <laughs> it's uh, been quite a day. A lot that we've got done today, but. Uh, whew. Uh, I don't know if you guys remember, we had a huge pussy willow tree, bush, whatever, in our backyard. Um, I'm going to take you that way. I'm going to try not to show you my project yet. So, there, just, uh, the heck? Dog kennel? I don't know. Okay, so, um, we cut down our, our pussy willow tree bush, and you can see that behind me. Right, oh, it's hard with the camera backwards. Right there, that's it. That's a, that's a pussy willow right there. Um, but we, we cut it down. Um, I'm gonna see if I can get in here to show you. Um, but as you can see, that's, that's the stump that we cut it from and all these shoots are coming out as we expected it would. So, uh, so yeah, um, we wanted to use the branches and things from the Pussy Willow because it's such a huge tree bush and I didn't want all that uh, wood to go to waste. So I'm kind of doing a little bit of a experiment sort of thing uh, with the big limbs and branches. So, uh, let me just show you what we have. Huh. I've made a um, kind of a little trellis fence, and I did a little work down here. Um, as you can see, I've got uh, those fence posts, doomahickey things. And because it's odd shaped um, wood, I just cut a few uh, blocks and hammered them in and it made it really really uh, tight but um, as you can see here there's a hole here I've drilled a couple holes in these branches and screwed through the branches and right into the branch so it stays but um, to make this look a little bit more rustic I'm gonna get some twine and wrap it around this to make it look like it's tied um, that's kind of kind of a cool idea I thought um, but yeah, as you can see, I've, I've kind of made, this one had a natural fork in it, so I cut the ends off, put a couple screws, one on each side to hold it here. Um, as you can see, another one, see there's the screw, but I'm going to take twine, you won't, you'll see that screw. And then another one, it's got a cool knot at the top, so I thought that was kind of neat. So a couple screws, they're sunk right into the branch, and I left them halfway in. And again, twine's going to hold that too. Um, this is not done, but the bugs are getting really bad out here. Ah, yeah, got another one. Oh. And <laughs> so this end I decided to put all of the thicker pieces at this end here, as you can see, more screws. And again, down at the bottom. Um, so yeah, this is my project. I'm going to put probably some more branches, probably going down here. Another cross one uh, up and down that. Maybe another one diagonal here. Another one diagonal there. Um, and this will be for vining plants and, and things like that. Um, we've left this little opening here. Uh, also, you remember that flooding problem? Uh, I'm tr working on a solution for that here as well. But uh, yeah, I'm trying to make myself a little kind of a outdoor no power drainage system to give the water a place to go so um, this is a spot where in my shed this is my shed <laughs> yeah <laughs> um, but as you can see there's all this mud here and that's all from the water it just comes down here and just collects up here and so I got this Huge door, right? And it collects at the bottom, and then has nowhere to go. So did this, 
and I'm going to dig that down pretty deep and maybe get um, a piece of uh, steel, put a board over the top, a uh, thick board over the top, and pound that into the ground and um, put some stones in there so the water has somewhere to go, like a drainage ditch system. But uh, yeah, this is my, this is my little project. Uh, I'm pretty proud of it. Uh, don't know what you guys think of it, but I think it's pretty cool. Once it has leaves and vines all over it, it's going to be like a natural barrier. And it'll give us a nice place to sit out here and uh, just enjoy the weather um, in the summer here. So guys, uh, that's it for my little project. And uh, I hope you enjoyed it. And um, yeah, so it's in the, getting the middle summer. And, uh, and there's a lot, of, a lot of stuff happening. I'm pretty excited, actually. Uh, I just am in the middle of switching jobs right now, too. So that's pretty cool. Um, if you like the videos, subscribe. And uh, comment if you'd like. If you have ideas for me. Uh, or more video ideas for us, for both Amanda and myself. Um, we'd love some suggestions. Um, of course, we try to answer as much as we can. We can't get to everybody sometimes. Um, but yeah, if you ask us a question directly, send us a message to our inbox and we will get to you or ask a question on the channel. Some, well, not the channel. Uh, we don't really answer the channel, but we answer the video questions. Um, so just uh, post on the thing down low and uh, we'll get to you. All right, bye guys.